Hi. So this week on Thingamavlogs, it's Peter Pan week. And you know how you can tell? Because I'm wearing this beanie. Well, I mean, I would, I would wear it even if it wasn't Peter Pan week. But it's definitely a symbol of Peter Pan. I thought I would make this video about something that's at the very core of Peter Pan. One of the things that makes Peter Pan, Peter Pan. Oh, you mean running away from your problems and never facing responsibility like a real adult? Uh... No, no, that's not it. Oh, well, then you must mean being absolutely mean to girls when in reality you actually like them a whole lot. No, man. No. Oh, you mean happy thoughts? That's the one. Yeah, yeah. So this video is about happy thoughts. <laughs> or more specifically, memories that I have that make me happy or, you know, take me to that happy place. Okay, okay. So let me paint the picture. Let me lay out the scene for you. So imagine it's kind of raining outside. It's drizzling, raining hardish. You know, it's not pouring. It's not a like typhoon or anything like that. But it's that mellow rain, that really soothing rain. Okay, so we got that. Next, you get a blankie and you pull the blankie over you. Not all the way, maybe to your waist as you sit on the couch. Then you put in the video games and you just zone out. Maybe a movie. I'll accept a movie. Uh, and if you want to have a little extra credit, then maybe you get some fast food. It's just like this really just super cozy atmosphere. Ugh! That's a happy thought. My next happy thought is actually a very specific moment in time. And I don't remember which year it was or how old I was or anything like that, but it was actually a Christmas. Again, let me paint a picture. Uh, Dad's got Bing Crosby playing on the record player. I don't know why we were playing record. It was like we had technology. So then it comes time to open the presents and everybody starts unwrapping their gifts. And, and like every kid at Christmas, you know, there's always something you want. And for me, it was video games, man. I wanted video games all the time. I always wanted video games. So we start opening our presents. We start unwrapping everything. And I'm getting like cool toys like Ninja Turtle action figure. Sweet. Giant stuffed dinosaur. Awesome. But no video game. Here comes the classic parent move. What's this? Oh my gosh, Santa left one more gift. I guess we forgot it. Dun 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 dun. Blum 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 blum. And then I open it. I go to town on this thing. And what do I get? Super Mario Brothers 2. I know you guys were expecting like some like super epic like game, but to me at the time this was that super epic game. I was so excited to get this. I immediately like just shredded all the paper and took it out of the box and ran over the Nintendo and put it in. I hit power, grabbed the controller, I look at the team ready to play, and then I look over at my parents and go, oh, can I, can I play right now? Of course, it's Christmas play, have fun, woo! Everybody just fell asleep on the couches and on the floor and in the chairs, and it was just like super cozy. It was like a Christmas slumber party miracle. So the beginning part of this happy thought probably doesn't sound all that unique because my happy thought is Disneyland, going to Disneyland. But the second part of my happy thought is unique to me because it's actually going to Disneyland with my girlfriend Sarah. And here I am. That's right, surprise. <laughs> You're my happy thought. Yeah, 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 yeah. I know it's cheesy, but listen, look. A ton of special moments in our relationship happened at Disneyland. Uh, we met at Disneyland. Um, we said I love you for the first time at Disneyland, and there are a lot of individual moments that I had with Sarah at Disneyland that let me know that she was just a really passionate person and she really cared about this idea of making magic, right? You know, when it's Christmas and the fake snow is coming down and you're just like, I love you, and it's snowing on us, and then, and then she's just like, I know, it's so awesome, I love the snow, and I'm like, babe, it's not really snow, it's, it's soap. And she's like, no, it's snow, and it's magical, and I'm like, yes. Yes, it is magical. I love you. She's like, Meow. that's magical to me. That's a happy thought. And I go there all the time in my mind, and it is a constant reminder of why I love her and why I'm happy. And finally, happy thought number four for me is actually a physical item because sometimes you have those little things that just are a reminder of your happiness. And mine happens to be this little guy. His name's Leo the Lion. When I was born, my dad came to my cradle in the hospital, uh, and he bought this little lion for me, and he put it in my crib. And he's like, you're my little lion, because my name's Leo. Leo the lion. <laughs> I don't know, it's just kind of like a symbol of my parents' love for me. It's the oldest toy that I own, the oldest thing that I own, really. I just, I love that I still have it, and it's a reminder of, of how much I love my family. It even has this little, like, pink string on it that my grandma used to hang it up on the wall, because my stuffed animals used to be all over my wall. And I never removed it, because it was another memory attached to this thing. And I don't know, I just think uh, nostalgia and memory is really important, and it's one of those things that drives me, so. Yeah. So now in the comments below, I want you guys to tell me what your happy thought is. And actually, I'm really curious to know because it could be anything. It's different for everybody. Everybody has something special that means something to them that they go to when they need to feel good and warm and, mm, you know, that feeling that, 
mm, feeling. It's a good feeling. So let me know, guys. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, do all that stuff. Thanks for watching Thingma Vlogs, and we'll see you next week.